Hello everyone, my name is Ashley and welcome back to Chef Life. Now a, lot of, now a lot of people have seen a lot of my first episode guys, so we now continue now with Chef Life, a restaurant simulator guys. Okay, so here we are, we got to talk to Kasim. Talk. The dining room is ready, I've set up all the furniture and since our grand opening is in two days, it's the perfect time to brush up on the basics before the big day. Hello, anyway, you here? So you're the ones opening the new restaurant. I'm Max, one to our city. Guys, she looks nice, don't she, guys? We'll see each other a lot, I'm sure. I do the deliveries for all the produce suppliers around here. I also take the orders, so we'll be talking often too. I'm looking forward to it, but before I go, I got some leftover stock from a previous del delivery, so I thought I'd just leave it with you, but not a word to my boss, okay? Consider it a gift. I'll leave you my number. Good luck with everything. I'll see you around. Wait, the delivery girl gave us free produce? That's amazing. We'll have to thank her somehow. Take a look at the recipe research table. See if those ingredients can be used in any new, new recipes. You have, you have met Matt, who is in charge of deliveries for your restaurant. She will sometimes drop by to let you know about discounts offered by your suppliers. Learn a recipe for Capri and Basil. Research table. Use research table to learn new recipes. Find the KP knowledge points you can unlock brand new recipes. Come on, the higher the grade you receive for these DJs, the more knowledge points you earn. The recipes are categorized by level, from basic meals to sophisticated di dishes. Most of the same recipe will become available as you level up. Level up. They are more complicated to make that make, but allow you to earn more money. The recipe you already own can be also be delivered, dropped in, delivered, delivered, developed in higher level dishes. So I want to learn Capri salad. Oh, here it is, Capri salad. You have unlocked the recipe for Capri, Capri and Basil. You need to make it at least once before you add it to your menu. Okay. New ingredients locked. Those red, these ingredients are now available on your shelves. New cookware available. Salmon manure and green beans. Unlock the recipe for salmon manure and green beans. These ingredients are now available on your shelves. Okay. Pin the, pin the recipe for Capri and Basil and pin the recipe for Sol. So, Capri will want to pin, so RS and Sol man Manure, whatever it is. Move your brand new dish, make your brand new dish mozzarella salad. So take all. There we are. Now we need, what was it? Ah, take all that we need. Okay, now we've got to step one. Storage and prepare, you can prepare this dish beforehand. When you make a brand new dish, so, ah. Oh. There we are, start. One, two, start. There we are, that's done. And start the mozzarella. There we are, take all. So that's done, make a brand new dish, so. We got that. Make bowls. Storage want storage want wants prepared. You can prepare this dish before and keep it in the refrigerator. So make bowls make cream. So I need that and that. So we need that and and the cooker. So cookware. We need this one. Um, this one here, right? RT cooking range. We need sugar and there we are. Right, so we want to high heat. Some foods are stick to the pan. Make sure to stir occasional to prevent. So LT to stir. There we are. There we are. We gotta do one more stir, guys, for the last bit. On medium heat. Right, so that's almost done. Stir it once more, just for good measure. So stir it once more. Okay, so that's done. Take. Well, right now that's done. So quit. 
Made it to a brand new Deez Mozzarella, so now we've done that. So now we've got to, um, made tomato slices, slice them, we've already done that. So that's done. Made tomato mozzarella, so, is it this one? Yes, yes, and yes. There we are. Season. Oh, oh we, we, we ain't got any seasoning, oh no. Take, right there we are. Done, done, then guys, this is hard. So we need a season. It's missing a lot of salt, so salt. Perfect, yes. Right. Then hold that. There we are, take. That is done. Now 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 that's done. Now we've got to make Capri and Basil. Plane station? Yes, and yes. Start. Okay guys, that was slow, wasn't it? Wait, we glad we got it though. So we always gotta remember guys, we, we, we always gotta remember that we've got to make we gotta make sure that we have the new learn recipe. That we got A, not bad. Take. Done. Made your brand new fi fish of soul. So we need take, take all, take all. Well, that's done. So, make fillet of soul. Storage one's prepared. Storage one's prepared. So that. Start. Okay. There we are. That's now done. Take. Right, that's done. Now we got that's done. Now we got to. So we need. So we need. Let's take this. Put it here for a second. Now we got guys. These guys. I'm going to be working slow, guys. I am. If when it comes to actual service. So we need the pot. Fill up water. That's done. Pot. Cooking range. Green beans, start. Season. Miss a lot of salt. But not enough salt, okay. Perfect, right, that's good. Right, let's take, take all. Well, that's done. Made a brand new, right, now we've got to frying pan the fish, so let's take that off. So, take the pot. Put it there. So now we've got the frying pan and fish. Well, now what we've got to do. Aha. So, Oh, that first, and then butter. Oh, you're missing the step. Flowered soil, huh? what? I, I, I swear I didn't say flour. You're not flour. What are you, what are you doing? What do we do with the flour then? Oh shit! Guys, what the hell? It didn't tell us to do flour. Well, now we've got the flour. Now we can do this. 
starts time probably. Some foods took bad, it took well, it took mean meaning it's already hot. To preheat cookware, place it on the range and turn on the heat. And it appears when it's not hot enough. As preheated, you can add the ingredients. So RB, turn it on. Well that's done. So we start. Then and, and we do add a butter then. Now we add a butter. Yes, that's right. We can't season it. We can't add seasoning, which is fine. <coughs> guys, this is a hard one to make. What, guys? I, I swear, I, I didn't see it say we need to put flour on it, unless I miss a step. That's done. A brand new fillet of fish. Right, it's done. Flour's done. Plane station. Yes and yes. It's the uh, green means of coal because we ain't got a finny station. <coughs> that looks fine. I, I don't want to redo the plating. So let's talk to you. Talk. I'm here setting up the store and we can order our produce starting tomorrow. I saw what you did with those two new dishes, they looked delicious. Do you want to work on them or do you want to try something else? Try something else. It's great to see you do it. By the way, I invite Max to live God to eat here tomorrow night. It's a chance for us to thank her for the extra produce and we, we can have a practice service. You're in the kitchen, me in the dining room. I think we've done all we can for today. We deserve a rest. I'll see you tomorrow. Guys, guys, where is our, um... So just so just listen. Talk. I just installed a blackboard. Doesn't it look great? That's where we'll write down the delicious dishes that our customers can order. So, what's on the menu for tonight? Come and find me in the store once you've decided. Menu creation. You, you choose the dishes for the evening service from the blackboard, okay. The customer will order the dishes shown here, the daily service will like to be, to be ordered. Based on the dishes you select, your menu involves a mace and may start to specialise in certain cuisine. As you level up, your dishes will become more of a sophisticated, putting these more advanced dishes on the menu will, pray, will raise the prestige. This one may all determine the ingredients you need for the evening service. So, daily special. Okay, that is done. Welcome to the storeroom. This is where you place orders for producing and ingredients. Every Everything stays in the fridge he fridges here to replace them on the kitchen shelves. I'll let you take a look around, but don't forget to put in an order so we can't cook without ingredients. Market. This is the market. You can order fresh produce from suppliers here. Each tile represents a different supplier. Look at what they offer and add the produce you want. Show the ingredients you need for this evening service here. Your need, needs will vary depending on what dishes are on the menu. So we need four, four, three, four, three, two, three. Let's go for agriculture, yeah? So we need four of these, three of these, two of them, and three of them. You have selected produce needed for the evening service. You can place order once you have checked your invoice. From your response, even when you didn't check the details of your orders, note that your responding might be affected by the origin of the produce you buy. And don't forget to place your order before leaving the market. Order on its way. Dread the orders on its way. In the meantime, you can put the finishing touches to the dining room. Order on its way. Enter design mode. 
Go into the closet and use one of the renovation stations inside your restaurant. In design mode, you can move each workstation. You can also add new ones if you, if you own them. Interact with workstations while in design mode. Open the catalog and choose which station you want in that location. So we want a certain cooking range here, kitchen. So let's put it here, yeah? And she's put it here. So customize. Cooking range. That's done. They've got a restaurant. You now customize your dining room by interacting with the furniture you want to change. Some day has a theme like Bistro or tra Trattoria. Having a multiple piece of furniture of the same theme will create a certain mood for the room. You would you also have access to a catalog for the kitchen and the dining room. Use the money you earn during the services to buy new items you can buy. You can then customize the restaurant to suit your style. So you want to decorate the kitchen. Enter design mode and decorate the restaurant. So design mode and decorate the restaurant. So I'm going to go over here. Customize. Hmm. That's like. Delivery is here. Oh, that's nice. Hmm. Yeah, it's fine. So that's delivery girl. Here's your first delivery. I've already put everything in your fridge, so no need to worry about that. By the way, produce will drop in quality if you leave it in the restaurant too long, so watch out. And they also have an expiration, expiration date. Keep that in mind because you want to serve fresh dishes to your customers. Oh, and I got Kat to see the message. Thanks for the invite. See you soon. Go to the stock management table to check your stocks. Pick up the crate. So pick up the crate. Take that crate. Expiration dates, prioritize quality, expiration date. That's done. Right, and then let the produce for the day and stock your shelves. Is that all? Yes, that's all of them. There we are! Green beans with shallots. Do you remember what our cooking shop used to say? Always preparing in advance is the key to success. With a new delivery, you can start preparing for this evening's practice service. Matt and I will act like regular customers, so make sure you've prepared some things in advance just like any other day. Okay, guys, with that being said, guys, that's going to do it for part two now, guys, of Chef Life, guys. Now, guys, I got confused there for a second, guys, because I obviously skipped. I obviously skipped a. Um, I obviously skipped a ingredient, a um, thing, a recipe bit to make the recipe. Anyway, guys, I really hope that you enjoyed, enjoyed this video, guys. If you did, don't forget to leave a like. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.